All right, before we get started, I wanted to say a huge thank you to everybody who has checked out my videos recently, all my new subscribers, anybody giving comments, all that love. I appreciate you guys so, so much. My video on Monday went far and above anything I could have expected. Again, thank you so much for it. I hope you guys stick around. I hope you guys enjoy the content. I play Pokemon. I love Pokemon to absolute death. It's my favorite thing in the whole world, and I like to have fun. So if you are interested into that and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do so. Today's first day for Pokemon Scarlet, Violet, all of that, dude. It's going to be an absolutely phenomenal year. So again, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you do so. And thank you all very, very much. Love you guys. Mwah! Let's get into Pokemon Scarlet. What is going on, all of you cool Caterpies? I'm Steezy, and thank you for checking out today's video. We've got an absolute banger of a video because today is Pokemon Scarlet and Violet's release. Guys, I have been waiting for this for so long. I don't know if I've been this hyped about a Pokemon game as long as I can even remember, to be honest with you. We've got a lot of adventure ahead of us, a lot of playthroughs I think we're going to have, and um, I know all the Pokemon already, so I have a good idea of my team that I'm going to have, and I think we just, we need to kind of just get right into it. Again, all of you guys who are new to the channel, thank you, first of all. Make sure you subscribe. We're all about Pokemon and having fun over here, so thank you for that. Let's go ahead and get into the game, though! Woohoo! Yeah, okay, I gotta take these off. I can't see. Alright, here we go. This is the very first, well, it's actually technically the second screen. We are choosing our, uh, choosing our, what I look like. I definitely have this. I'm as white as possible, and I usually have dark hair, but I don't today. And we already know what my name is, ST, and I absolutely love that I can pick numbers. Three, four... Uh, whoops, through Z and Y. That is phenomenal that I can put numbers in my name. I don't know why I like that so much, but that's definitely something I like to do. Change hairstyle. This one actually did look kind of like my hair now, but it doesn't need to look like me, right? Let's just have some cool hair. Okay, that's kind of slit. That's kind of uh... a pompadour. What's that? Oh, that's kind of like the hair that I have. Whoops. Pixie cut. I just like knowing the names of all these hairs. Look at the textures on this dude's hair. Oh, bro. No, I guess I only part one way. Bowl cut. <laughs> I wish that looked like... Um... Oh, that looks... Emma, if you're watching this, we should do this with your hair. That is actually fire. Uh, space buns. <laughs> What is going on with all these hairs? I love it. Let me go ahead and... I feel like that is how most people's hair is these days. Okay. We're just going to stick with... We're just... No, hold on. Where was that one that was... That was uh, most like mine. That one? Yeah, we're going to rock with that one. Confirm. Yes. And my hair is actually that color, so we're going to rock with that. Change the look? I didn't think we could change looks. Oh my word. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, I've been told that when I laugh, I have um, Asian-looking eyes. So we need to find some that look the most Asian. Does that look Asian? That don't look like me, does it? That one? I feel like that looks like me. Uh, we have brown eyes. Oh, Hazel's the first one. How adorable. I'm already on brown, so that's cool. Eyelashes. I don't care about eyelashes, do I? No, we're leaving away. I want eyebrows, because I have thick eyebrows, bro. Look at my eyebrows. we got to find the thickest boys up here. Come on, give me them fat boys. You know, uh, fun fact about me, if I don't shave, I have um, a unibrow. And that is not fun or funny, but I'm going to laugh, otherwise I'll cry. Uh, those actually look kind of... No, mine look more like caterpillars. <laughs> Where's the caterpillar? <laughs> I hate that it looks like me. <laughs> Mouth. I don't know. Can I find the goofiest looking one? That one looks like a cat. Do I need to have a cat mouth? Are these even changing? Let's go with the cat mouth. 
What do I, uh, lipstick? I don't want a lipstick. What would I look like with lipstick? Oh, oh, that's kind of cute, right? I look so cute. Let's go back to no color. Uh, a beauty spot? I don't think I have any of those. No. Um, and then freckles. I unfortunately don't have freckles. I kind of wish that I did. Um, okay, I'm done now. What now? Just go back. Okay, there we go. Cool. So that's me. That's me. I'm ready. So that was kind of cool. I know that they couldn't do a whole lot of, um, like, clothes and stuff. So it makes sense that they would focus on being able to do eyes and stuff. Enrollment complete. Now saving on the screen. Blah, blah, blah. We're absolutely going to disable the autosave. I can't remember why that's important, but we're going to do that at some point. Also, this is not Burger King. I'm just using it because of the ice. <laughs> we, we got out of G Fuel today, buddy. Taking lessons from tradition, growing stronger and greater. Dude, I like that girl swag. <clears throat> Who's that? Is that Albert Einstein? There's a colossal a talon flame. Who's this girl? I can't remember what their, her name is. It's so insane, the absolute uh, quality of graphics here. This is Director Clavel, and he's the head of the Nar... Naranya Academy? Nar... Naranya? We're going Naranya. Look at the map. I should probably read these, shouldn't I? And it's also, of course, home to the mysterious creatures known at, to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers, in fact. Who's gonna pop out? Pop me. <laughs> Look at the fur textures! Are you kidding me? This is nuts! Pommy is so pretty and ugly. Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas and the skies, even in our cities and towns. We humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. That's such a fun word. Look at that dude's hair. Oh, there's a Raichu! Oh, yes! There's a Raichu! Look at him down there! That's my boy! And we got another one over there, but that's my boy! Heck yes! Naranya Academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners. Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. Dude, those are the eyes I need over there. <laughs> Hey, there is Paldean Tauros right there. And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon to do battles growing alongside them. While our robust, robust curriculum of co-work helps our students draw forth their fullest potential. That outfit on the far left is amazing. We, the faculty and staff of Naranya Academy, can't wait to welcome you with open arms. Thanks, man. Oh, look who it is. It's Coridon, right? I'm pretty sure that's Coridon. Or Moridon? No, Coridon makes sense. I don't know why. That screen is beautiful. Oh, there's one of our teammates right there. That bird. I actually don't think I've talked about on my socials or on any of my videos what uh, my team is going to be. Look how amazing this is. Flamigos. Yo, this is sick. There's that town we saw a whole bunch in the trailers. No idea what this lighthouse is about. Probably important. Did my boy just dive into the water? Oh, look at them birds. I can't remember what their names are. I probably only remember the names of the Pokemon that I like. <laughs> this is my house. Dude, real quick, that house is stunning. That house is absolutely stunning. I would totally live there. Now saving. Um, we're going to be working on, as far as this episode, where the best place to put my camera is. So if it's in the way for anything, I apologize. All right, there's me, my dope shoes, and my dope socks. 
I look tired, don't I? What's up, man? What's up? Okay, I did read the only negative reviews of this game so far is that it's kind of laggy. I definitely feel it right away. I'm not gonna lie. Your mom built these shelves herself. They're neatly decorated with their belongings. You know what I said? Your mom? Why is there never a dad in any of these? Is that strange? I guess it's not in any of them. 90% of these games do not have dads. Squovet! Muncha! <laughs> if I ever catch a Squovet again, I'm gonna name it Muncha. There's a Tauros back there. It almost looks like it says Steezy. Don't it? It says S-T-E-A-T -E maybe? That's dope. What's up this way? Your mom's... That's your mom's room. Better not go in there without asking. Keep that in mind, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Keep that in mind. Oh, look at that doll up there. And there's a bed over there. This just looks so freaking good. There's mom. Our moms are usually good looking ladies, too. Let's be honest. What's up, mom? Good morning, Steezy. Is that how my mom sounds? This is how my mom really sounds. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. Well, it is your first day at your new school after all. No, she doesn't sound like that. I'm excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me. What? The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little while longer. That's weird. Their words, not mine. <laughs> Apparently, there's something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Is it our Pokemon? Somebody's at the door. I'll get it. I'll get it. I kind of like this guy's haircut. Maybe that's the very thing we're waiting for. Steezy, get the door, would you? I feel like I would walk faster than that in real life. Dude, bro just walks in my house? I guess we do that, though, don't we? Do forgive the intrusion. I want his shoes. You are Master Steezy, yes? He already knows. He already knows. On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. Ah, and also for my delay in introducing myself. So wag. This dude has so wag. I'm the director of the Narenya Academy. You may call me Mr. Clavel. I'm probably going to pronounce all of these often. The director? And you came in person to help my son on his first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any failures on its part. So here, at last, are the enrollment documents that you should that should have already been delivered to you. It's a cool bag. Look how pretty she is. Her eyes. Goodness, you really needn't have... Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? This game is shouting out to me. I almost always have a cup of tea. If I'm not drinking G Fuel, I've got a cup of tea next to me. Ah, uh, no need to trouble yourself. Steezy, I've got a thing or two to discuss with you, the director here. Why don't you head back up to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. I don't want to wear that stupid hat, Mom. Now, Mr. Clavel, you simply must join me for a cuppa. This way. <laughs> How can I refuse such a kind offer? Do you see the eyeballs he gave me? Give me a death stare. He's just chilling over there. Shout out to all my homies that actually know this inside joke. We have a glass table at my house. <laughs> if you know, you know. If you know, you know. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so, first of all, there is no wall in my room, it looks like. I'm in a loft. Which is crazy. You'd be able to hear everything I've got going on. Yes, I'm ready to put on the stupid hat, Mom. The backpack's kind of fire. And it's way better than the sword and shield hat. Or er, bag. The hat's not bad either, I guess. I look like a young proper Indiana Jones. Um, yeah, we already know all this stuff. Same old Pokemon stuff. What does that screen look like, though? Okay, let's go ahead and turn the text speed up. Skip move learning. Send a box as manual. Give nicknames on, of course. Vertical camera, blah, 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 blah. Auto save off. Show nicknames. Skip cutscenes? Heck no, I want to keep cutscenes, right? Pokemon, you can do different- Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Control or rumble, I don't care. Okay. That- Man, the settings are even better now. Okay, so I've got my stuff. Can I go to school now? 
I want to get a Pokemon. Oh, my favorite flowers. Oh, just look at you. All ready for your big first day. Her shirt has a spoon and a Pokeball. Do you eat Pokeballs? Yes, the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Oh, gracious. Oh, what? That says gracious, right? For some reason, I was thinking it said gracias, but that's spelled way differently. <laughs> I'm so dumb. I'd entirely forgotten that I have something else for you, Master Steezy. A most important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? I love that he calls me Master Steezy. I wonder what the important thing might be. Let's follow the director out and see, shall we? Gotta move my drinks on how long I've been recording. Okay. I know the intro to all of these games usually takes a while. So the first episode is probably going to be a little longer than, than the rest. There's that dope house. Man, wouldn't you just love to live there? Look at the back, too. A beautiful um, view of the ocean, I guess. Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. Do we get our Pokeballs right now? Yay! Oh, gosh, yay! We provide each student entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I'll ask you to choose among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, the grass cat Pokemon. Fue Coco, the fire croc Pokemon. <laughs> and Quaxly, the duckling Pokemon. They're all very good company. Why, they usually refuse to even leave my side. Look at how adorable Fue Coco is. <laughs> What's this? So it turns out they're more interested in you, Master Cece, than familiar old me. I do wish I could say and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off to my next home visit. I'll be at the house just over there. Take your time with your decision, then come find me once your mind is made up. Now, if you'll excuse me, until next time we meet. Oh, man. What a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose just one, right? Not an easy task. Why not take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones and get to know them? I'm sure they have lots to teach you. Oh, but before you go, I've got a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you are going out on your own. Oh, a Rodham phone. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, we already know what the Rodham phone is. Brand new. According to the instructions, you can check the map by pressing Y. That's a cool new gadget. I think this time we're actually going to use it as a phone as well. People are going to call us. Man, so what do we even do with these guys? How do we even choose? Look at this. Sprigatito is the one most interested in me. Can I talk to you? Adorable. Quaxley, what do you got to... I'm literally right on top of you. I just took a sit. I just sat on that poor duck's head. <laughs> I just took a sit on that poor guy's head. I think Foy Coco has the most um, spunky attitude. Also, have you noticed that this is completely free roam, free camera? Like the wild area of Pokemon Sword and Shield? This is 100% free roam. That might make my head hurt after a while. I need to slow it down. Can I... Oh, I can zoom out a little bit. Zoom in. Oh, wait, here's a Pokeball. I think that's what that means. Yep. Wish I could run. No, that ain't running. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, it totally shows me the Pokemon around here. Hold on, let's just get out of this for right now. Let's take a look at this Pokeball. Look at Fikoko! Look at them over there. This is just so... I don't even know. The word that came to mind was astonishing, but that's kind of a weird word to use. This is just so amazing. Oh, look at the birds on top of my house. How absolutely adorable. Oh, there's another Pokeball. Alright, so while we're walking around and trying to find all the Pokeballs that my house has to offer, I'll be honest with you guys. I have been so, so, so back and forth on which starter to choose. I have talked to a few of my friends about who they're choosing, who I'm choosing, and like all that stuff. And I literally, at 
some point or another have been like, yeah, I'm gonna go Foy Coco. Oh, I'm gonna go Sprigatito. Man, Quaxley's kind of the one. I don't... <laughs> and... I just... I really don't know. I still don't know. I'm hoping that by the time I have to choose, that um, I'm gonna have a good feeling about it. I don't know. Uh, we've seen the leaked photos, right? If you haven't seen my video about the leaked photos... Um, the Pokedex, we already know what everybody looks, what they're going to turn into, and that's really the key. Because Fue Coco, if he, if we, oh, hi guys, where is Fue Coco? There he is. If he didn't evolve into such an ugly guy, he would be my favorite. This guy is so absolutely adorable. But he's so hideous. <laughs> he evolves into such a hideous Pokemon. And then Sprigatito is a cat who turns into an even cooler cat, and then turns into a... A meh cat. What did he find? He sees that water and he wants to go go into the water. And then Sprigatito. I just... Oh, well, we just talked about Sprigatito. Quaxley, though. Pff, Quaxley is a blue-footed booby, which is hilarious. And I love that evolve. Or his first evolve. And then his second evolve is... Or his final one is kind of... I don't know, man. This is Cabo Poco. It's not much, just a little pinch of community, but it's home. Are you kidding me? This is amazing. Absolutely incredible. Look at my house. I will not get over it. I'm gonna move here for real. We could finally run too. Alright, what's this guy gonna say? The power of science. Bet. Power of science is amazing. If you connect with friends, you can head out on adventures together, up to four of you at a time. That might have to be an episode where I hang out with people. Look at this, look at this, look at this! Our first Pokemon! You need to take these Pokemon to your neighbor's house. I know, but look. Okay, great. Get off my screen. There's um, a Pokemon. Tarantula, I think, right? Tarantula. I don't know. Super rad. I like that they're on the mini-map, too. First of all, there's a mini-map. Second of all, the on the mini-map, it shows us where we need to go with that exclamation point. I really need to stop and think about what, uh, what Pokemon I'm going to choose. When I left work yesterday, I was super confident about um, choosing Quaxley because Foy Coco is essentially off the table for me. So I thought Quaxley because blue-footed boobies are awesome. <laughs> but I'm not entirely sure. Okay, here we go. Here's the screen. Oh, I smell the flowers. The textures, bro. The textures. We've already seen this opening scene a whole bunch, I think, haven't we? Oh, I thought that whole time he was trying to cook that orange. He wasn't. He sneezed. How did I miss that? Are these... Oh, I remember when we first saw that screen, we thought that that meant we could get all three starters. Not quite, Master. Steezy has yet to make his choice, you see. What's this girl's name? Winona? Naomi? I think it's Naomi. I do wonder which one of these three he will choose. Oh, God. I don't know. I don't know. Man, 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 man. I want to know who you guys chose. I want to know in the comments below who you guys chose. This is super rough for me. So, bueno, buenas, buenas. We haven't met, have we? Naomi, am I right? Clavel, I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. Hang on, Director. Is this who I think it is? Yes, this is our Academy's newest student, Master Steezy. He will be attending as of today. So you're that kid who moved up the road. Literally, you can see my house right behind me. I've been dying to find out more about you. Listen, listen, girl. Listen, you. Oh, I was close. Nimona. Listen, Na Naoma. Nimona. Nimona. You can get to know me anytime, girl. What's up? I'm Nimona. Normally, I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Want to be friends? Absolutely. <laughs> I love your enthusiasm. We're gonna get along just fine. Yes, I'll marry you. Fine. Miss Nimona is president of our student council and champion rank trainer in her own right. I absolutely love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should battle right now. You and me. 
Easy now. You two will be on the same class, so you'll have plenty of time to battle later. And get to know one another better, of course. We're going to be neighbors and classmates. Nice. We'll be able to battle all we want. On that note, Master Steezy. Ugh. Have you decided which Pokemon you would like to be your first partner? No, I haven't. Clavel, what are you doing to me? Oh, I hate this, guys. I really, really hate this. Oh, my gosh. This is absolutely the hardest starting choice I've ever had to make. In every generation, there's always one where you're like, that is my Pokemon. This one, I love and hate them all equally. <laughs> oh, man. Boy, Coco's the best starter. But then he turns into such an ugly crocodile. Quaxley's uh, last evolve has the goofiest, dumbest looking toes. And Sprigatito is very mad. I'm going to go Sprigatito, I guess. Spr That's Sprigatito, a grass type Pokemon. It can use its plant powers to soak up whatever water you throw at it. Would you like to go with our good grass type Pokemon Sprigatito here? I think so. Spurr! Oh crap, I gotta come up with a nickname. I had nicknames for Foy Coco and for Quaxley. I do not have a nickname for Sprigatito. Yes. Okay. Time out. <laughs> Time out. Okay. It actually took me a, a little bit of looking, but I think I have the greatest name. Oh crap, no! I clicked wrong. <laughs> I backed up too far. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can nickname him at any point, so um, we'll just get to that nickname when we get to that nickname. The cat is floating. Look, the cat is literally floating on my arm. Okay, so we've got our Pokemon. Whether or not this is going to be the greatest idea, I don't know. But I will end up playing this game several times on the channel for um, Nuzlocke and like Poison-type only kind of playthroughs, so we'll end up playing with all of the starters at some point. Sprigatito seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Master Steezy. This is your first Pokemon, yes? Please raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked away safely inside a Pokeball. Negative. I can have Pokemon walking with me. Sprigatito's gonna be walking with me. I can't believe you actually chose Sprigatito. Me either, Nimona. Nim yeah, Nimona. I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a good combo. Thanks. Thanks. Can I choose one of these Pokemon too? Why? But did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy, Miss Nimona? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Steezy while he raises his own new partner. Indeed. Rather splendid idea. That is a that is a good idea. I'll give that to you. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on equal footing with Master Steezy here, I shall be more than happy to allow it. Does she pick the one that's stronger than me? Nope. She goes for Quaxley, the weaker one. I kind of wish I would have chose him. Oh, dang. Now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. Man, that was a tough choice. Look at Foy Coco back there. Man, I, I don't know. One of these times, I'm probably going to play with all three of them, too. So I might play this game four times. As you may have noticed, Miss Nimona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling. But I do hope you'll join her for a battle. It will help you get to know your own Pokemon as well. Okay, okay, so there's the explanation point, And it tells us that there is a quest, I guess, maybe, to check out. Let's see if I can nickname my Pokemon, though. Okay, great. Uh, bag. Pokemon. Where's my Pokemon bag? Am I tripping? Berries, battle items, Pokeballs, medicines, key items, picnic items, treasures, team materials, TMs, other items. So how the heck do I get... There's my map. I don't know how to get to my Pokemon. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, well, shoot. I don't know how to change the nickname. We'll change it eventually. 
We'll change it eventually. Wait, hold on. Always check your surroundings. There's got to be a Pokeball or something around here. Dratini. You know how sick would it have been if um, Dragonair would have gotten a new evolution? Okay, a potion. This free roam is awesome, but I will get a headache. <laughs> Mm, there's another Pokeball at least. There's one up there. How the heck do we get up there, though? Oranges. Oh, my gosh. She's already down there. You know, I was thinking about, like, um, I need kind of a Pokemon tattoo. Pokeball tattoo. And I really like this logo up here. Those colors and stuff. Man, I got a feeling there's a really good Pokeball right around this corner. There's a path. Well, let's just go find out what the path is real quick. We'll do the path, and we'll do this first battle, and then that's probably what we're going to call the first episode. I knew it. This better be good because of how far back it was. It's probably just a Pokeball. Oh, I was hoping I could just run over it. I was right. It's a Pokeball. Okay. Let's go battle Nimona. We both have new level 5 Pokemon, and she does have the the type disadvantage but since they're such a low level it's probably really not gonna matter but we'll see anyone can be a pokemon trainer as long as they have pokemon by their side and it's our duty as trainers to help our pokemon grow stronger through battle so you're ready to battle steezy heck yes let's get it popping girl perfecto i'm so excited for this battle i think i'll use your only new pokemon i assume I trust you remember that Master Steezy is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon. Uh, no I'm not. <laughs> Whoops, good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. Yeah, take it easy on me. I've only ever beat every Pokemon game ever. Come on, Steezy, let's have us a fruitful battle. I do enjoy fruit. Oh, she's even got freckles and a nice, sharp, pointy nose. She's so adorable! Quaxly, it's Brigatito. <sighs> okay, now, I know this is your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. Okay, bet. I want to say that we can... No, for some reason I was thinking we could, like, change the camera ourselves, but... Battle. Ooh, we do! Leafage? So bet, this should be a two-hit KO right here. What's he gonna do? Scratch? Wing attack? Smart move, grass against water. I know this. This is not my first rodeo. <laughs> Aren't you more experienced than that? Goodbye! <laughs> Bye, Quaxley. Juicy boy Coco back there watching? That's so adorable. Got our first level up. Look at these screens. These. Oh, wait, you didn't get to see it. It was behind the camera. I didn't even pay attention. Wow, not bad, neighbor. I like these notifications. It's almost like phone notifications. Look at you winning your first battle ever. You've got even more potential than I thought. You're going to be a strong trainer for sure. But now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. Master Steezy and his Brigatito surely weary already from the... No? Ah, oh, sorry. I kind of got caught up on all the excitement. I want to see who else she had. I'm really sorry, Steezy. Same to your Sprigatito, too. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Alright, thanks, Steezy. You two seem to be becoming best friends. You two seem to be coming. Holy crap. You two seem to be becoming fast friends. Though you've only just met. Can I count on you to take our new schoolmate here under your wing, Miss Nimona? I'm sure he can learn a great deal from a champion ranked trainer such as yourself. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me. Since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you definitely need. You have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a second. Yeah, I literally just got it like five minutes ago. The Pokedex app. That makes sense. Will automatically register Pokemon you catch. It's a must-have for Pokemon trainers. It's a super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jacques, right, actually made it himself. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile Pokedexes. It's quite the age we live in now. 
Oof. <laughs> Oof. Filling out a Pokedex by hand? I can't even imagine how much work that would take. <laughs> no, I suppose you can't. Yet, no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. This is truly a timeless pleasure. And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard toward the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. You would assume that she, that Nimona already has that done. Now, Miss Naoma, man, holy crap, I'll get her name someday. Now, Miss Nimona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. Could I depend on you to see Master Seizy to the Academy? You would be doing me quite the favor. Of course, leave it to me. Then I leave him in your capable hands. All right, little one, it's time you and I were on our way. It's like a bird. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. All right. Speaking of Pokedexes, CZ, you've probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the academy. Oh, I wish we could skip that. Am I getting a phone call? Oh, no. I wish we could just skip this. At the beginning of a Pokemon game, I have a dream. That you could say, I'm super familiar with Pokemon. You don't need to show me anything. Weasel's out here. Hophip's out here. Oh, that's my ma. Hi, ma. Oh, Steezy, I hear that Nimona here will be taking you to school. Yeah, she's my girlfriend, mom. That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend? Yeah, she's gonna be my wife. And I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you at the school. Plus, so many handy facilities you couldn't use as much as you like. Add in your new friend, Nimona, and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. My mom's such a sweet lady. Now, you'll be staying in the school dorm, so I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed a lunch for your first few days or something like that. A sandwich from my mom. A sandwich is a dish made by sandwich vegetables, meats, or other ingredients between two pieces of bread. It makes a fantastic meal when out on a picnic. I'm actually a vegetarian, Mom. You better take these two. Five potions? Bet. I know you every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Hey, shout out to one of the best movies ever made. Spider-Man Far From Home. Just try to savor them all, the good times and the hard times too. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. What an angel. Oh, all right then. You two better head off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. I kind of want his hat in real life. Your mother's so nice, Steezy. Well, she's going to be your mother-in-law, so it's kind of like we're sharing. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, vamos. <laughs> I love it. I love there's a little bit of Spanish. This way. I love there's a little bit of Spanish in it. From where I'm from, we actually have... Okay, there we go. We actually have um, a rather large Spanish-speaking community. And um, I also work for a Japanese company. So I'm trying very hard to learn several different languages at once. So this game actually might help me. <laughs> I think that's actually where we're going to end it right here, though. I'm going to go ahead and uh, smile save in a minute. But that is the first episode of Pokemon Scarlet. I'm having so much fun! I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a thumbs up. I greatly appreciate it. And remember, all my cool Caterpies, if you are new to the channel, you love Pokemon and you love having fun and you like a little bit of weirdness, this is your channel. So subscribe if you haven't already. And I think that's all I've got. I'll be uploading this a bunch throughout the week. At, at least three times a day. Three times a week. Not three times a day. But uh, that's all I got for you. So again, cool Caterpies. I hope you have a cool day. And I'll check you guys in the next one. <gasps> Toodles!